Big Lotto is one of the hottest rappers in the music industry. She represents the Clayton County area of Georgia, where artists like Waka Flock and others made their name. In school, she dealt with bullying and all the typical pressures of being stereotyped, but started entering and winning writing competitions at a young age and loving poetry. Believe it or not, she was drag racing before her rap career. Her dad used to build custom cars that the rappers would rent out for their video shoots, so she was always on the scene. While wanting to do what other girls her age was doing, her father would make her go to open mics and competitions and went by the name Miss Mulatto. The name being controversial to most, she chose to stick with it, feeling that she would take a negative word and turn it into something positive for her. In 2016, she was on the TV series The Rap Game, produced by Jermaine Dupri and Queen Latifah. She won the eight-week competition and also a contract from Jermaine Dupri, but she didn't accept it, saying that it wasn't enough money for her, so she took the independent route. After releasing Miss Mulatto mixtape in 2016 and then following up with Lotto Let Em Know mixtape in 2017, she released an EP called Time and Pressure at the end of 2017. In 2018, she changed her name to Just Mulatto and released the mixtape in the same name. 2019 came and she released the song Bitch From The South and the song reached the Billboard Top 100. The song took off and from there things started taking off. She released an EP called Hit The Lotto in December of 2019. She was coming back to back with projects and singles and on the low sign with the record label RCA at the end of 2019. She caught the attention of her favorite rapper, Gucci Man. Gucci Man often says that he's mad he didn't sign her. She happened to link with him on a remake of his song, Freaky Girl, and called it Moobop. During her rollout plan, the pandemic hit and as most people plan stalled, her buzz got even bigger during this time. After dropping plenty of visuals and doing features, she became one of the biggest rappers from Atlanta. Right now she's celebrating the lifestyle that comes with being successful at what she does from her music doing numbers to shows on the road and putting out good music. And even going through the changing of her name to Lotto and realizing what her old name brought along with it. Now she's been releasing new music under her new name and applying much pressure in the entertainment industry. For those trying to know her dating status, she's been trying to keep that private. It says that everything's going good so she doesn't want to introduce who she's dating. Calling herself Queen of the South was making a bold statement, especially with how sensitive people fans can be, even the artists themselves. She had a couple of internet back and forth with some artists, but it wasn't about who's Queen of the South. She always shouts out other female rappers, especially Trina and her favorite, Nicki Minaj. But right now, she knows it's her turn. From the extravagant events, to the flashy lifestyle, and the music and numbers to back it up, it's hard to argue with her on being the new Queen of the South. <laughs> 